hi welcome to my channel today I'm going to be doing an unboxing of some shoes that are reminiscent of the hot boots of the fall this season which are the YSL boots booties is it YSL I think it's YSL why I sell booties? Excuse me. Yeah, those crystal booties Rihanna was wearing. You know, I, I, I don't know about you guys, but I didn't feel like swiping my debit card for $10,000. So I found the next best thing for me. Um, I went on a lookout and I went to jo Go Jane's website and I found me, you know, a pair of boots. I saw them. They had three colors. They came in black, pewter, and dusty pink. And I, of course, decided to go with black because it, I, I just felt like it would be a good place to start with the boots, with flashy as those boots are. So anyway, let's get to the unboxing. Um, here we go. So the boots came in this black box. You know, standard black box. Nothing special about it at all. I wear a seven and a half, seven, seven to seven and a half. And I would tell you, as I'm getting older and my feet are starting to feel the brunt of every uh, strap across my toe, um, I'm to the point now where I want comfort in my shoes. And I know back in the day, you probably could never get me to wear an A. Oh, no, those things are too big. I'm not wearing an A. Uh-uh, 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 no. I ordered these shoes in a size 8. And let me tell you, they these shoes run extremely small. So, I would have returned them and went up to an 8.5, but they didn't have an 8.5. I think on Jane's site, in the color black, they only have like a 7 seven and a half and a five left in, in the in this style so I just I'm gonna put on some thick socks and walk around the house until I can no longer stand it and take the shoes off but to stretch the boots out that's what exactly what I plan to do but anyway enough rambling let's get to the shoes that's what you guys are here for right I got you so um I will tell you that I have ordered tons of shoes I'm not going to say tons. That's stretching it. I've ordered a lot of shoes from Go Jane's website. And I was really impressed with these boots. Um, first of all, in the box, the boots came, has its own little dust bag. I mean, when's the last time you got a pair of shoes off Go Jane's site that had its own dust bag? Uh, I will go ahead and share this. But back in the day, um, I ordered me some some replica Christian Louboutin shoes and they came in a red dust bag but other than that this is the second pair of shoes that I've ever bought that had a dust bag okay before you start judging me about replica Louboutin shoes have you ever heard of that saying fake it until you make it okay so quit playing but I don't really wear those shoes a lot Actually, I haven't worn those shoes in a couple of years, to be quite honest with you. But anyway, I'm rambling. So, back to the shoes that you guys are here for to see. And these are the slap... They're, they're, excuse me. I can't talk right now. Sorry, I had a long day. Okay? But these shoes are slouchy. As you can see, look, look at these shoes. Do y'all see that bling? And mind you, the camera is making them look like really, really out there blingy, but they are very understated. It's an understated type of bling in this color black. Um, the rhinestones are black. And uh, so, yeah, just, just check these boots out. Not bad, huh, for some boots that came from China, you know. I noticed what y'all was thinking. But anyway, here's the boots. I'm telling you, I was beyond impressed with the craftsmanship of these boots. I was concerned because I have thick calves. And I was concerned about not being able to get these up. You know, get my legs through. I was concerned about the tightness of these. But they're not tight at all. The 
the the discomfort right now is in that pointed toe because as you can see with the pointed toe silhouette your toes are going to be squished in so I would get actually rate these shoes a five I, I was going to give them a four four stars due to them you know running small but I think it's just the way that the pointed toe shoes are that's why you have to go up in size if you want to allow um, room for your foot to be comfortable but of course um, they didn't have an eight and a half or I would have went up to an eight and a half but um so these are the boots and I'm telling you I was quite surprised that these shoes came with a extra set of heel taps. I know, right? <laughs> I know exactly what you guys was thinking cuz I was thinking the same thing. Go ahead, China. So yeah, they came with a extra pair of uh, heel taps and I'm tell you something these shoes the heel of these shoes look look at that y'all check that out they are really made extremely well and then the bottom of the shoe is feels like suede right here I know China right but anyway so they're almost sold out in black in this size, um, but they do have them in pewter, and I, I actually thought about ordering them in a pewter color, because, you know, pewter is kind of like a metallically uh, dark, silverish color, but I did end up ordering me some, another pair of shoes, YSL dupes, off of another website, and I will do a another unboxing video once those come in the mail they should come this week but i don't know i really don't think that they're going to beat the quality of these shoes but go out and cop these before one thing i do like about go jane website they do restock if most if something goes out of stock and it's a hot item they will restock it so actually guys i love these shoes so much if they restock these shoes I plan to order them in like a size eight and a half nine. Yes, I know, right? But I, I am. I'm, I've been checking their website to see if they restock these. Um, I did get these while they were on sale. I think the regular price is a hundred and nine dollars, and I ended up getting, I think, a thirty-five, forty percent discount, which brought them to sixty something, and then it was twelve dollars shipping. I know, right? Twelve dollars shipping, but um. In the end, uh, so far I think it's worth it though. I did notice that when I put on a thick pair of socks and wear them around the house, it does loosen up the uh, inside, you know, the inside of the shoe a little bit for me. So that's a good thing. And I think it, once I start wearing them and really break them in, they should be, they'll be okay. But anyway, go ahead and order these nicely. Uh, rim, uh, YSL dupes. I'm not gonna call them a dupe because I think the YSL boots come all the way up the knee. These come like sort of a little bit below the knee, but more than the mid shaft. If you're kind of in between that length, but um. I definitely don't think you guys would be disappointed. But anyway, I just want to take this time out and say thank you for watching my first video. I plan to bring more fashion videos and thrift finds. And I'm going to be doing a remix of, you know, thrift, thrift clothes, vintage clothes. Just mixing it with everyday um, fashion items. Just doing a remix, you know, I, I, my motto is be you, be original. And um, so subscribe so you can be notified, especially when I post a video about the silver um, shoes that I have coming in the mail for dupes for the YSL booties. But again, thank you guys for watching.